So this is how you can request payment on Pioneer. So all you have to do is to go to your Pioneer, just click on sign in and sign into your Pioneer. So I'm trying to sign in right now. As you can see, so I want to sign in with my second account. I want to show you something. So I'm at the dashboard right now, as you can see. So to request the payment, go to get paid and request the payment. You click on request the payment. So I want to request payment. You enter the person's email. I want to request payment from, let me just use one of my email as example right now. So you click on, look like you are trying to add a new payment. Yes, click next to continue. So it is individual. If, if you are requesting payment from company, you'll have to enter the company name, the company URL, contact first name, the contact that you have in the company that is the person that you are connected to that um, you want to assess the payment through so the contact first name the contact last name and the country so but let me just use individual so what is the first name of the person let us use Femi last name or they so what's the country? United States. United States of America. So as you can see here, states, it will ask for states if it is United States, but for other countries, it might not ask for state. So you can just go to, let's say Florida, and you click on next. So the next, this is where you enter the amount. So let's say you want to collect just 150, once a request for $150 USD. Description, maybe logo design. Logo design. So due date. Due date is the date that you want the payment to expire that the clients might not pay again. But in most cases, the client can still pay even after the due date. So just click let's say 29. Uh, do I want to request payment as my name, Femi Odemi, or as Design Notch? You know, this is my own personal name. I, I use Femi Odemi yeah, normally. I ought not to use Femi Odemi because this is my own name, but I could not even think of another name to use. So I just use another. So do I want to request payment as Femi Odemi or as Design Notch? So let me just use Design Notch. In this case, it won't show my name to the person I'm requesting the payment from. In case you are maybe you are working on Fiverr and you use a US account, you use a fake name, and you don't want the client to know your real name, you can use if you have a business account on your on your Pioneer, you can request payment through your business account from your business profile. So I want to request payment as Design Notch. So you click on Next. This is where you add the attachment. So you can add the attachment here. That is attach up to five documents like your invoice maybe your invoice or work contact maybe it's a chart where you where you guys discussed payment yeah or just something that shows where you guys chatted and where you guys agree on the price so then you click on preview you can preview it or click on payment request if you click on payment request it generates the payment request or preview so let us just click preview the payment has been requested. Payment request was sent to Femi Odemi. So share direct link with payer. So you can just copy the link here and share it to the payer through your chat. You can just paste it. It will be a direct link to where he or she will make the payment. Although the person will get the link to the email since you've sent it here. As you can see, a payment request has been sent. The payer will get the link to pay. Or you can just you can also share a direct link here. But most times I do share direct link to it. So I will just tell the payer that, okay, well, I've sent the payment request and you can pay it here. So that's how you can request payment. But you must note that Pioneer payment request requires you to have made up to $5,000 before you can make payment request. Let me show you what I mean by that in one second through my second account. On this account, I've made more than $5,000 so I can request payment. But as you can see sign out so i'm trying to log into my second account right now 
so this is my second account so get paid Pay receive a receiving account payment request a payment so let's click on request the payment you see that i won't be able to request me payment because i'm yet to make up to five thousand dollar as you can see on the dashboard to enable request the payment you must first receive at least five thousand us dollar or equivalent via the global payment service which enables you to receive local payment from companies worldwide or any of the marketplace where any of the marketplace network or business platform integrated to pioneer so you must have made up to five thousand dollar before you can do this so as you can see i've st still still to hand so i need to earn two thousand dollar more so that i can request payments that means i've only received close to three thousand usd on this particular account so if on your account you have not made up to that amount you've not made up to five thousand usd so you won't be able to use the payment request uh, feature on pioneer so in that case it might be hard for you to request payment so but if you want to do this and you maybe you really want to do it and you are doing something legit so it is someone that you've offered a service to that you want to request payment for you know i exchange pioneer so if you have pioneer i exchange pioneer at one of the best rate so if you want to request payment i can help you request payment and you can sell the pioneer to me so if you'll be selling the pioneer to me if you'll be exchanging from me i can help you request payment as long as you're requesting it from a uh, for a legit reason so you can contact me you check the description below so this is how you can request payment and thanks for watching this video bye bye